everyone, and welcome back to my next new video. Today we're playing Pokemon Legends of Arceus. Yep, now you're probably wondering, what are you doing playing again? Well, I thought since the last episode was mostly just about the people talking, not seeing any action, I figured we could do a new another episode. So today we're going to do, today, basically what we're doing is a special double episode. That's right, everybody. As always, like and subscribe to the Junior Crew. Comment down below and hit the bell notification to be notified on my latest videos. And if you're all ready, please let us begin. I'll try to hurry up with the with the voice editing. What a lovely weather we got. I hope you had a nice sleep, even if the sun is strange and new to you. Let's go to headquarters. Captain Sillen is waiting. All right. The server court's offices are here on the first floor. No, good. Keep those eyes open. The wild Pokemon did they were everywhere, attacking from all sides. And then up my partner Pokemon, but against a whole pack on number. This is what happens when you go to so far a fight. By the medical corps. Medical corps. We'll put you to right. This man's with the security corps, and even with his own partner, he took a beating from wild Pokemon. Without a partner Pokemon of your own, you might find this trial particularly trying. Captain Sillen, Junior is here. You may enter. Let us get straight to it. If you wish to join the Galaxy Exp Expedition Team, prove yourself capable by going out into the obsidian field lands and catching three different species of Pokemon, Bidoof, Starly, and Shinx. Catching, catching three Pokemon from oh. the start, oh, no, no one in the uh, galaxy yeah, team yeah. has ever managed that. Did this stranger not catch three different Pokemon only yesterday? My try should be simple enough for him. If it, the professor wasn't extra, ex, extradigating, thing that is. It was a bit exaggerating. Sorry, folks. Anyways, <clears throat> the county team does not have the means to provide for those who only take without go giving. If you wish to stay, you must prove yourself beyond any doubt that you'll be an asset to our cause. I will lend you one of our survival corp satchels to carry whenever, whatever you may need in the field. Cool. That satchel doesn't exactly match your uh, model of dress. Akira, expect. 
like you to step in if anything goes wrong. Aware. The Galaxy Team ent Entry Trial. Press Y button while consulting the map on your art phone. And you can check the task you have waiting there. There are two tip types of missions and requests. Missions must be completed in progress in your adventure, while requests are optional and given by people you meet. Partner, come with me a moment. Now then, a jolly good morning to everyone. Is something the matter, Professor Laventon? In order to complete our Pokedex and while we'll simply surviving in this unforgiving land, Jiria's absolute must pass this trial. And as a professor of Pokemon, I've got just the ticket to help accomplish that. Go on, Junior. Pick the Pokemon that strikes your fancy. With a partner of your own, you'll be able to fight off wild Pokemon outside the village. These little darwins are very dear to me, but it's plain to see that they rather curious about you. Well, my boy, which Pokemon would you like to keep as your very own? Well, let's see. Tentacle? Rowlet? Rabbit, Cinecrow, Asha. Let's see. Eeny, my, my, you. It's Cyndaquil. Do you want Cyndaquil as your first partner? Yes, I do. <laughs> and with that, one of the Pokemon you caught at Brood Beach for me will now be yours to keep. Good show. I took Cyndaquil back inside its Pokeball for you, so take it, it's yours. You received Cyndaquil. A word of advice, my boy. Pay close attention to which Pokeballs are empty and which ones. Contain a Pokemon when you're out in the field. They look as if they're cheering on their friend Cyndaquil. Or perhaps they're jealous that it gets to help you with your trial. That could well be. They did go dashing from the village when Junior fell out of the sky. Well, not to worry. You two, I'll have you assist me with my research for now. By the by, what species has Captain Sue in charge you with catching? Well, that smashing all three of those species can be found in Obsidian Field Lands. Let me give you some Pokeballs to use during your trial then. You see 20 Pokeballs. These Pokeballs may be handcrafted, but they work a treat, as you already see. You'll have this trial clear in no time. I guess you're finally ready. You'll have to leave the village for your trial. Turn left after you exit headquarters, then head for the gates. Got it.
Oh, what a curious getup you have there. I can already tell you're quite the character. I'm Vu of the Ginkgo Guide, the go-to choice for any of your mercantile needs here in Hishu. I heard talk about you found from the sky, didn't you? Now that's certainly a tale I liked like to hear. Oh, and you've a Pokemon. You're certainly full of interesting surprises. Investigating the odd is noble is key to any good merchant success. So what do you say? How about you and I see how our Pokemon stand to one another in battle? Sounds good. I like you better and better. What a delightful find. I heard about this try your two attempt. Let's have a quick bow to get your blood pumping before you head out. Though I hope you know you'll lose if your Pokemon HP reaches zero. Yeah, I know. Move items, use them well, and the world will open up to you. That boy, that, I will not voice over, I'll just say it, you know. It's always good fun to have your Pokemon do battle, don't you think? And as they gain experience through battle, they'll learn more moves to get a low, grow even stronger. Pokemon sometimes learn new moves when they level up. If you change, if you want to change the moves your Pokemon can use in battle, open your satchel, choose your Pokemon you want, and select change move option. But so few people here have their own Pokemon, if only more knew how to use Pokeballs. At any rate, let me help our two battlers recover from their little exercise. And to you, my sky falling friend, I present some potions and thanks. Thank you. You can use them on your Pokemon whenever they might go be worn out from battle. I'll be hoping that you're successful on the trial of yours. Warranting Galaxy members means more customers for yours truly after all. Bye. That really is something. Not only can you catch Pokemon, you can lead them in battle. Now to Obsidian Field Lands. Yeah. When you're leaving Jubilee Village, make sure you choose a destination from your map and tell rest the guardsmen where you're going. That way someone can come to your aid if you're knocked out by a Pokemon. Your trial begins just a short ways past that front gate. Alright. I don't need that. You're doing correct. I was informed you'd be passing through. Your trial will be taking place outside the safety of the village. Please take care and to come back alive. 
Got it. Let's go to Obsidian Field. Anyone else feel like mining for Obsidian? <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Great fun, bro. Well, it says Obsidian. What do you think? <laughs> this is our base camp. The last safe heaven before you reach the wilds. For your trial, you must catch three species of Pokemon, Fiduf, Starry, and Shinx. Are you ready to get started? Oh, Professor, is something wrong? Ah, uh, well, you see... Captain Sillen got a hold of me after you left. She impressed upon that I bear full responsibility for whatever happens to... Our sudden guest. That's our unsparring captain. But what help exactly can you offer out here, Professor? To be honest, my dear girl, I don't intend to lift a finger. Junior's talents are the real deal. He'll pass with flying colors, you see. Ah, so the responsibility for him still lies, in fact, with me then. Well, I'm sure Jane will be fine. Let's begin the trial. Yes, let's do. Fair warning, people. There will be certain parts I'll do to our voices. And other parts I'll just let the voice over take over. Like now. This is Aspiration Hill. The species of Pogon you're meant to catch all live here. And along comes the Badoo. Time to get ready to catch it. The key is to aim carefully. Not that you seem to need my advice. I'm just sharing what I know. Hold down the ZR button to focus on a wild Pokemon. And keep it in your sight as long as it's nearby. This technique comes in very useful when aiming Pokeball. At a target or when dodging Pokemon's attacks. The doof have a mellow disposition. That means it tends not to run away from people. So this will be easy. Okay. Got it. You caught a Bidoof. Well done. Time to find your next Pokemon. That's a story. They're skittish little things. They'll run if startled. But you should be able to get close to them. If you crouch, you'll be harder to spot. Okay. Press the B button to crouch and make sure, make it harder for wild Pokemon to notice you. Press the same button again to rise. If you keep if you creep into the tall grass while crouching low, you'll be even harder for wild Pokemon to detect. All right.
wait for it, gotta wait for it. Gotta get a little bit closer. Come here. That star you caught as well. Only one more Pokemon to go. Can I just walk up here? Just to do the tree? Yes, I know where I'm going. I just want to do this tree. That's all I want to do. Just that one tree. I forgot. There's something I ought to teach you since you're still new to this. Here's a proper way to throw your partner's Pokeball. As Captain Sillen tells us, have an item at the ready but when to send our Pokemon, press X. Have a Pokemon at the ready but want to throw an item, press X. The Captains are real expert on these things. Try throwing your Pokemon balls at rocks or trees like this one to have it investigated. If your Pokemon finds any berries or other items, it'll bring them to you. Now it's time for your partners to shine. We're we'll reach your final hurdle catching a Pokemon. That Shinx. Shinx has an aggressive disposition. Could you already tell that? More or less. I think you might. I can never tell until I focus on a Pokemon carefully. Once aggressive Pokemon get irritated, they'll knock aside any balls you throw at them. When you use the uh, button to focus on a Pokemon, you see how easy it may, it may be to catch a Pokemon. The more arrows you see pointing up above a Pokemon, the easier it will be to catch. An X icon will appear above a Pokemon if it's picked a fight with you. Be warned, Pokemon displaying this icon cannot be caught. Unless you engage them in battle. Don't worry though, I'll teach you the trick to catching aggressive Pokemon. You got to battle them. Once you have absorbed with battle, you can throw a Pokeball at them and try to catch them. Right now you got several Pokemon of your own, don't you? Take one of their Pokeballs and throw it near a po wild Pokemon you want to battle. I got no doubt you'll hold your own in battle. Thank you. Easy to start a battle against a wild Pokemon. Simply draw a Pokeball that contains one of your Pokemon, one of your own Pokemon added. As you can see, the, if you can see that I currently have an item, read it to draw not a Pokemon, press X. It will allow you to toggle between your draw item and your Pokemon team. All right. Let's do this. Why did I do that? I wasted a Pokeball. You approached those Pokemon without a hint of fear and caught each one. 
You like a gift the sky dropped to us. With you at our side, I think the server cards has a real chance of complying a complete Pokedex as we've been ordered. This is wonderful. I'm curious why on earth you came far from the sky like you did, but for now, let's tell the professor we're ready to head back. Okay. Oh, I said you passed a try with flying towers, and it seems you went and did just that. Congratulations, Junior. You've taken your first step toward seeking out every Pokemon. This calls for a commer commemorative photograph. Yeah. With skills like yours, I suppose this was a foregone conclusion. Now then, let's bed to report to Captain Sun. Time to head back to July Village, eh? Yes. In time, you'll be able to send Pokemon you've caught to live in the village pastures. You can bring up to six Pokemon with you into the field, in theory. Though we never had anyone skilled enough to do so. Come on, you two. Let's not dilly-dally. Captain Sin awaits our report at headquarters. I bet Captain Sillen will be pleased. All right. It seems he won't have to leave you to die after all. Seriously, you guys creep me out with that. Congratulations. You passed your trial. You can now hold on to that satchel. You must admit, you I must admit, you impressed me. I said a high huddle to judge whether a stranger like yourself could be worthy, but you cleared it. This is yours, your official uniform on the server. Corpse. Welcome to the team. You receive a, a survey corpse uniform and a pair of survey corpse sandals. Go ahead into the room you used last night. Then you your report to the dirt floor. <coughs> Present yourself in uniform to our commander. This is your first official order from your captain. Alrighty. Okay, time to go get dressed.
Yeah, it's not on change. I have to put your server card in a pot and two Okay, let's see. In the form. Yeah, those. Let's see. No. I want white color contacts. Yes. White eyes. Look how well our survival corpse uniform suits you. It's always as if the captain had it tanned just for you. Thanks. I think you changed. Regarding your occupation, you may continue to use your room you slept in last night. You may wear this as well. Thank you, miss. You're welcome. Now, set these up to the captain. Got it. By the way, Akira, Akira right? I think it's her name. A-K-A-R-A. -A let me know in the comments down below if I'm not saying her name right. You look great too. Bye. Oh yeah. Can I have a pickle? No. Oh. Brother, there's no pickles. They what? don't have any. What about cookies? Well, I think they have cookies. Yay, can I have a cookie then? No. Why don't no one give me a cookie? I have been waiting for you. I am Com Commando, Commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. Hmm, so you are Junior. Yes, sir. Hmm. I've been briefing on the situation, including how you fell from the rift in the sky. Now then, let's see what you're made of. Face me in combat. Alright. I'll try to draw him. Yeah! Oh. Hmm, you got some fight in you. I just got tossed. Your sumo needs work, but I do see some potential. Don't expect a warm welcome from everyone. Naturally, some will be slow to trust an outsider, who literally fell right out of the blue. The suspicion among us might see you arrival as a potential a disaster. But you passed the trial that was put to you. No matter how odd you may seem, you're part of the Jubilee Village now. Dedicate yourself to the work of the Galaxy Expedition Team and complete the Pokedex. Complete the Pokedex. But I must warn you, Junior. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. Keep your wits about you as you work. 
Yes, sir. The Galaxy Team Entry Trial. Complete. So the commander has accepted you. Has also accepted you. Just understand this. You begin as a no star, recruiting among our ranks. In other words, you have no rank at all. Perform well as a member of the Survival Corps and you will move up through the ranks. Indeed, you see the more you add to the Pokedex, the higher your rank will become. To seek out every last Pokemon. Here you will need this. You obtained all recipe for crafting Pokeballs. Mm, nice. A crafting recipe from scratch. Required to is one Apricot and one Couple Stone. And three thousand dollars as well. You will have to buy the necessary materials. I'm not gonna buy. I'm just gonna save. Akira, Akira, you're an expert at crafting yourself. Teach our new recruit what he needs to know. Of course, Captain Sillen. Now, as the experienced craft person here, let me explain a bit to start with. Crafting making means making items with your own two hands. You can buy items at the general store by self division is worth striving for. You can even make our most valuable tools, Pokeballs, think we'd be able if we couldn't do that. Let's head to the craft works. The base of crafting. Alright, let's do this, folks. At Oshawa. I'll be back for you too because I want you to do you too as well. Okay. Bye. <laughs> well, the earning enough place in our team. My name, my name is Anthony. I am the local clothier. The professor asks that I, re, I, I ready you a change of clothes. So here you go. I do hope for it. You see an everyday kimono and a pair of everyday trousers. I hope you avail yourself to the village humble shops. This way, to the craft works, Junior. Got it, I'm on my way. You can use the workbench here at the craft work anytime you need to make an item in the village. And I also find what you need to make your first Pokeballs once you're ready to begin calling my way of saying congratulations on joining us. Just spend the money you got from the captain on clothes or whatever you think is best. Go on to the workbench and choose an item to craft in this case a Pokeball. You can use workbench in Dubai Bird and has and have the base camp grab Pokeballs and air items. Craft items require a recipe and the necessary materials.
Vases are crafting. Oh no, that's some fine craftsmanship. Hard to believe this was your first time stepping up to it. The workbench, my boy. You recall the course that Pokemon possesses the all power to shrink themselves down. With the Pokeballs we craft, we can make use of the power to catch them. Also, that more Pokemon species can be dull recorded on the in a Pokedex. And on the other note, here you are. You received the Pokedex. A volume of completing the co collecting results of much Pokemon research. Professor Leventon continually adds to it with each report made on new Pokemon features. Let's see. That's better. I read this volume just for you. I hope it aids you well in your aim to seek out the Pokemon that are in this grand region. You'll have to complete lots of research tasks to help the professor fill out the Pokedex. The same goes for me, of course. I always got Pokemon to research as a server courts member. I too be happy to explain more about the research task. I could use your assistance with. Come join me at the field land camp whenever you are raised, my good junior. <laughs> hey, excuse me. I get I couldn't help but over here. If you're going to the field camp, would you mind taking care of Uncle Quest for me? I'm standing guard, so I can't leave my post. But I'll be here at headquarters if you want to talk about it. People who are who have something to ask you will have the request icon display, displayed above them. If you fulfill the request, you may receive a nice reward. Sure, why not? I'm in town, so everybody, get your requests out. Oh, I already got three customers. Hey, so, there's these Pokemon called Wormpole. Have you heard of it? Yes, I have. Well, you see, I am having a chat with Professor Laventon, and he told me that after a Pokemon gains a certain amount of experience through battling and that and the like, it will sometimes change its appearance and become stronger. He said it's a phenomenon called evolution. Some Pokemon can undergo evolution, will change their appearance and stats. If one Pokemon one of your Pokemon has met the requirement to evolve, you'll be able to select the evolve option when viewing the Pokemon in your satchel. So I decided I want to raise a Wormpole myself and have it evolve. You're part of Survival Corpse, aren't you? If you catch a Wormpole, could you let me have it? There'll be a reward in it for you, I promise. Just give me a Wormpole if you can. Alright, sure. I'll get him a worm ball. Hello! You're the newcomer who fell from the sky. Are you heading outside the village? Of course you are. The survivor course must have to get up and complete the... About the combined that Pokedex. Book, they're working on it. Right? Well, on your way, kind of do me a favor. Find out all about Starly. Pokemon certainly are terrifying creatures. But when I see Starly, I feel all whole. Not that I have a least desire to actually touch one, mind you. Please, wait till you see a Starly entire, entire in that Pokedex. The moment you complete it, 
Sure, miss. Alright. I know Shakespeare's have on markings on the inside, but what the, were they? No use. I can't remember. This keeps up all night. Keeps me up all night. Hey, aren't you with the sur survey corpse? If you catch a sheet, could you show me? T show it to me. I gotta see one with my own eyes. Please, I can't remember for the life of me what those ears look like. It's driven me up the wall. Got one of those sheets to show me? Yeah. All right, let's have a peek of those rounded ears. That's it. If you just have the yellow cross pattern and them, kind of like a star. Can't tell you know, what a relief this is. Felt like I had a bone stuck in my throat. Only the throat, my brain, and the bone thought. Thanks for helping me get through that bone out. I don't get it. Oh yeah, I got some potion. Now... I guess for now. Oh, okay. There we go. Save our progress. Hang outside the village, are we? Stay safe out there, kid. Okay, we got two requests. So we're going to do the worm pull and get the star request complete. Get two and one. Alright, here's where I'm just going to do the voices because I just want to get to this and play. Right, let's get to it, shall we? In complete... In order to complete this Pokedex of ours, there are a great many research tasks I'll need your help to carry out, my boy. The details of these tasks can be found in Pokedex for you to reference any time. These are tasks, are tasks you need to carry out to complete the Pokedex. Each Pokemon species has a different number and variety of research tasks. Press the down button to open your Pokedex to check what kinds of research tasks are available for your Pokemon you re registered. When you focus on a wild Pokemon in the field, using the ZL button, you can usually instantly check the research task for that species of pressing the down button. To open your Pokedex right to the page, some Pokemon have some unusual research tasks, so be for sure to check them out. You must catch and battle diverse Pokemon species and carry out plenty of research tasks. Do so and you'll gain <coughs> research points and other rewards for your work. One last piece of advice, Junior. If you see a wild Pokemon attacking coming your way, dodge like your life depends on it. Dodge? Here, watch closely and remember what I do so you can do it later. Sure. That beautiful flowing bit of gymnastics is what we call a dodge. If you light on your feet, you can dodge out all the way of a wild Pokemon's attacks. That hopefully you can avoid taking a big and blocking out in the wilderness. That security course has clicked me when I got the business end up some chinks on their shock.
But don't worry, I got lots of experience to draw out, and I'll teach you plenty. Ah. Hold on a second, folks. Hold on a second. My controller died, so hang on. There we go. My guy is on the charger now, so I can continue. Thank you. She's cool. Now, let me share some Survivor Court's wisdom. Focus on the Pokemon with the ZL button, then press down to open the Pokedex. You have no seeds the some tasks you have to do for that Pokemon. You might notice that you have to research the task and do with many but you caught. That's right, catching one just isn't enough. You need two, then four, then more and more. And when it comes time to battle Pokemon, remember the caption switch wisdom. If you have items, press X to regular Pokemon. If you want, I'll go on ahead. Thank you. every time. Why have to get intro the uh, story book that like, complete? Didn't want to do that, but oh well. I'm always going to get lucky every time. I am going to miss. I go up here. Oh, I could just do this. Yes, I played before, folks. Switch. Ooh. 
I gotta get the materials. I think you got it, but as a reminder, don't forget to open your Pokedex when you are focused on the Pokemon to check your research task for it. Just yell down and try checking your task for Starry next. Once your task is to catch the river, I'll be inspired, right? For that task, try catching them while hiding in some tall grass. I'll go wait for you ahead. Come and catch you up once you finish some tasks. Will do. Next time I'm going to catch it a worm pole. Ow. They need to be careful. everybody I'm gonna end the episode here I'm gonna hide in this tall grass all right everybody that's all I have for today's video don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below and tell me what you think will happen next as always stay tuned and stay positive folks tune in next time for what happens next bye bye bye